the delectable ballad of the waller lot from love songs of childhood this is a librivox recording all librivox recordings are in the public domain for more information or to volunteer please visit l i b r i v o x dot o r g recording by squinvaj lakova love songs of childhood by eugene field the delectable ballad of the waller lot up yonder in buena park there is a famous spot in legend and in history eclept the waller lot their children play in daytime and lovers stroll by dark for tis the goodliest trysting place in all buena park once on a time that beauteous maid sweet little sissy not took out her pretty doll to walk within the waller lot while thus she fared from ravenswood came injuns o'er the plain and seized upon that beauteous maid and rent her doll in twain oh twas a piteous thing to hear her lamentations wild she tore her golden curls and cried my child my child my child alas what cared those injun chiefs how bitterly wailed she they never had been mothers and they could not hope to be have done with tears they rudely quoth then they bound her hands for they proposed to take her off to distant border lands but joy from mr eddy's barn doth willie clow behold the sight that makes his hair rise up and all his blood run cold he put his fingers in his mouth and whistled long and clear and presently a goodly horde of cowboys did appear cried willie clow my comrades bold haste to the waller lot and rescue from that injun band our charming sissy knot spare neither injun buck nor squaw but smite them hide and hair spare neither sex nor age nor size and no condition spare then sped that cowboy band away full of vengeful wrath and kendall evans rode ahead upon a hickory lath and next came gallant daddy field and willie's brother kent the eddy boys and robbie james on murderous purpose bent for they were much beholden to that maid in sooth the lot were very very much in love with charming sissy not what wonder she was beauty's queen and good beyond compare moreover it was known she was her wealthy father's heir now when the injuns saw that band they trembled with affright and yet they thought the cheapest thing to do was stay and fight so sturdily they stood their ground nor would their prisoner yield despite the wrath of willie clow and gallant daddy field oh never fiercer battle raged upon the waller lot and never blood more freely flowed than flowed for sissy not an injun chief of monstrous size got kendall evans down and robbie james was soon o'erthrown by one of great renown and daddy field was sorely done and willie clow was hurt and all that gallant cowboy band lay wallowing in the dirt but still they strove with might and main till all the waller lot was strewn with hair and guts of gore all all for sissy not then cried the maiden in despair alas i sadly fear that battle and my hopes are lost unless some help appear lo as she spoke she saw afar the rescuer looming up the pride of all buena park clow's famous yellow pup now sick em don the maiden cried now sick em don she cried obedient don at once complied as ordered so did he he sicked em all so passing well that overcome by fright the indian horde gave up the fray and safely sought in flight they ran and ran and ran and ran o'er valley plain and hill and if they are not walking now why then they're running still the cowboys rose up from the dust with faces black and blue remember beauteous maid said they we've bled and died for you and though we suffer grievously we gladly hail the lot that brings us toils and pains and wounds for charming sissy not but sissy not still wailed and wept and still her fate reviled for who could patch her dolly up who who could mend her child then out her doting mother came and soothed her daughter then grieve not my darling i will sew your dolly up again joy soon succeeded into grief and tears were soon dried up and dignities were heaped upon clow's noble yellow pup him all that goodly company did as deliverer hail they tied a ribbon round his neck another round his tail and every anniversary day upon the waller lot they celebrate the victory won for charming sissy not and i the poet of these folk am ordered to compile this truly famous history in good old ballad style which having done as to have earned the sweet rewards of fame and what same style i did begin i now shall end the same so let us sing long live the king long live the queen and jack long live the ten spot and the ace 
and also all the pack. End of the delectable ballad of the Waller Lot.